Well, it only seems fitting that the Tupelo Salvation Army is opening a safe place for homeless veterans to get a new start on life the week that we're honoring their service to our country. Yeah, that's right. It is another way to honor the country's heroes. Allie Martin takes a tour and has more. For months, workers have been transforming the old Salvation Army men's dorm building into a shelter specifically for homeless veterans. We had numerous volunteer groups come in and then my husband and I did a lot of the work ourselves. Um, floors had to come up, um, we stained the concrete, um, paint had to go up, new lighting had to go up, there was plumbing and electrical work. It really is a facelift on the old dormitory that was there. There is enough room for eight men, an activity room for socializing and fellowship, a washer and dryer, and a shower. Before the new space was available, veterans stayed in the Jim Ingram Red Shield Lodge. However, a veteran-specific dorm was needed because of the unique needs and common bonds shared by those who have served. People at the Red Shield Lodge can stay for four months while being charged a small weekly fee. The guidelines are different for the veteran's shelter. Maximum stay for six months for the veterans, and because our veterans have given such a high personal cost to our country and service, we're gonna serve them cost-free. And so it won't, won't be any fees for them to be able to stay. Captain Marion says having a space for veterans allows the Salvation Army to now apply for grants to help pay for housing the heroes and other expenses such as utilities and regular maintenance. Telling your story in Tupelo, Allie Martin, WCBI News.